Hello guys, Luke here, and it is not Wednesday today, it is indeed Saturday. Whoop whoop, and welcome to Krusty Saturday. Yay! It's like 3 in the afternoon right now and I just woke up because I just could not sleep last night. What I want to talk about today is like sort of serious. It's not like... In you, you could say it's an issue, it just depends, like, who's interpreting it. Humanity now is just so obsessed with systems. Like, we, our lives have turned into a conveyor belt machine. If you think about it, everyone does the same thing. We were born, we go to school, we do extracurriculars, maybe, if we feel like it. Then we go out and get a job after we go to college, of course. Because if you don't go to college, mm -mm, you are considered... Just don't talk to me, peasant. I am surprised that humans are not boxes yet. Just have to open your mind, really look around you and think. Where you're sitting right now, look up from the video, look away from your screen, and look around how many boxes, A, are you in, and B, are surrounding you? Let's take a little field trip. Please forgive my dirty room, okay? But this has turned into vlog status. I sleep in a box. I communicate and socialize with my friends with a box. I look at the communication device through a box. I store my clothes in a box. I store more of my clothes in a box. My childhood was a box. And this is the scariest. It wasn't always like this, but it's sort of a pretty big part of a lot of people in the world. The Bible is a box. We live in a world where everything is boxes. We are born in a box. We are born in the hospital box. We are put into the incubation box until we are taken out and we are driven in our metal boxes with wheels back home to our home boxes, to be later put into school boxes, to go to high school boxes, to go to college boxes, to eventually get a job where you can work in an office cubicle box. It scares the absolute crap out of me. And you know what? Humans are not made to be in boxes all the time. Let me show you a little something that I guarantee each and every one of you use every day. Prepare yourself. Bam, it's a toilet. It's mostly round. Now this round toilet is round because the person who designed the toilet was thinking, hmm, someone is gonna be taking craps on here every day. And you know, it's gotta be comfortable for they asses, right? Because nobody wants to sit on something uncomfortable when they take a giant dump. Now, imagine if this was a box. Would you want to sit on that and take a dump? No, I, didn't, I don't think so, there. No, you don't want this to be a box. A corner would go into your butt cheek and impale you and it would hurt. The reason the toilet is a circle is because it's comfortable for us. We sit on it. We don't want to sit on a box because that's not natural for us. In nature, nothing's a box. Most everything's circular. The earth is a sphere, okay? Liberty will never perish. Now, why is it that our current society is so obsessed with boxes, so obsessed with systems, so obsessed with being ordinary, everyone being the same? It's because we're so afraid of change. We're so afraid of going out where we're not comfortable. We're so afraid of the unexpected. This whole box thing is not completely my idea. I heard a poem by some pretty much no-name poet a while ago, and it kind of like opened my eyes to this. What I want you to get out of this is to break out of this cycle. And there are a lot of people ahead of me that have tried to be a whistleblower to this. Break out of the system, break out of the boxes, go into the world. The earth is a sphere. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you know somebody who would like this video, please share it. Hope you all have an amazing weekend. Bye.